Hello and welcome to The Man Games. In today's video we're going to create a new attire for Kenny Omega. He is the AW Champion on Universe Mode here at The Man Games. He has been on Smackdown recently. So if you have missed that and um, you like the sound of it, make sure you check that video out on the channel. So seeing as you know, he's doing a lot on the channel at the moment, thought we'd freshen up his look and give him more of a current um, look for the channel. Because at the moment he's just in um, black pants and black boots. So I thought we'd just jazz him up and make him look a bit more current and a bit more better for the channel. So going into clothing, you see the Kenny Omega there. So this is just a Kenny Omega from the community creation. Um, I've had this one on the channel for quite a while now. But you know, there might be better ones out there. I've not really look, looked into it really. So actually, just go back, of course. It's so you can, as you can see there, that's how he's meant to look. But when it's downloaded, it's not worked properly. It might have been because I didn't have enough room on the game at the time. Um, if you don't have enough room on your game, then you can watch a video on how to make room on your 2K20. There'll be a link in the description below. Make sure you check that video out. So we'll just click on the entrance attire there, and now you see it's gone back to the just plain black. Um, because it's easier to create the entrance version first and then go onto the ring attire and then just delete parts off, off it. It just, just works out easier, in, well, in my opinion, anyway. So, we want like a cutout t shirt. That's what we're looking for. So, like, that's too big, that's too small, that's too long. So, what's that one? Is that similar? And that looks a bit like what Chavo Guerrero used to wear. So yeah, I think we're gonna have to settle for this one. So we're gonna color that in. We're gonna color that in black. Go down there. Go to that images. So I want to put a Bullet Club image on this. So if we go down to the bottom. So there should be no nope, across there. That's one that I've downloaded off the community creation earlier on today so I know it's not exactly the same one as like the, the you know the one he's been wearing recently but that yeah, is close close enough so there we go that is that that's that so I don't think we need to change anything else on here no so now we've got a lower so the tight So we want something a bit like more jazzier really. So at the moment he kind of he has like one one leg, you know, one kind of colour and one like another colour really. But I don't know if that's something you can actually do on the game. Unless you know you do it yourself. So it doesn't look like it. And going through these so what we'll do is we'll go into that click that again go back to images designs maybe so we'll see but I'm sure one legs like kind of like a fiery a tyree he's been wearing currently or it is you know when I'm creating this video so I wonder if there's like a fire you know Maybe we might have on some of the custom ones, maybe something a bit fire related. But it doesn't seem to be. So I suppose we could use something like. Hmm. We'll come back to that, or maybe, because I'm. It might be able to make that look a bit fireish, maybe. Mm. So I'm not seeing anything that's real fiery, so what we'll do is we'll go up. Right, so we'll click on that, we'll apply that. Now what we want to do is we just want it on. 
that sounded like if we can do it, but I'm not sure if it's gonna work. Do you see what I mean? Like, I suppose it's worked there a little bit. See, for some reason, it's not going around. See, it is when you do it that way, but now it's taking it away that side. So I'm not sure whether. So we'll just make it a little bit longer. So the best thing might be to just do that. Oh, and you can't change the colour of it. That doesn't help us at all then. Okay, so that's not worked. Right, okay. I honestly thought there'd be some like fire. What's this one? That's what supernova wears. I wonder if you can change. So if we can change. Yeah, you can. Oh, yeah, you can. So is that going to be like. to do. So let's just click on that for a second. That's that. That's what we've just been on. That's that. That's that. What does that change? Oh, it changes that. So no, that's not going to work either. Okay, so this has been a bit more problematic than I anticipated. Um, okay. We could always just put three bellas on him. We won't do that. Um, right, right, right. Right. So, go back. Something in WWE design that we've not thought of, maybe. You know, Kane's quite a fiery character. There might be some fire logo that we could potentially use, maybe. Um, up here. We're not having a great lot of luck here, are we? Or even Seth Rollins burning down. I honestly thought we would have seen something kind of fiery. Um, no luck, but. Not so far, not so far. So that's not really what we want, is it? Because it's just the word can. Steamboats is a bit fiery, but. So if we did, just to say we did use Ricky, but you know, if we stretch it out like that, you can't really tell it's Ricky, can you? So I suppose now you can, though. So yeah, that's not really going to work, is it? Unless. Once we click that, change the colours a bit, so then maybe you can't tell that, you know, it's actually Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. We change that to yellow as well. See, now it doesn't look like, you know, a person. So, that's that one now. So, if you change that one to red as well, and yeah, we kind of need that yellow. So, what if we change that back to red then? And that's not great though, is it? But... And now you can tell again that it's the Dragon Steamboat. 
Right, okay. So that didn't work. So what if we turn canes upside down? Or to the side even? So if we put that one on that way like that. It's already quite fiery, so we don't need to change it. But then if we go back onto it, click on into it again, go to images again. Do we redesign again? So now we just need to find the Kane logo again. So there we go. So there it's there. So we'll make it long again. Like that. Make it wider so it goes over this side. So is it intervening with that part quite well? So I've not really changed any colours, but it doesn't really go into each other very goodly, does it? Goodly? Is that a word? But at least it does look fiery, so if you move it to there, that you know takes more of the area. So I'm not, you know, overly happy with it, but I suppose it's what we're dealing with at the moment. So now the other leg, so we need to go back onto that and go back to images as well. So I'm sure on, on the other leg, it just kind of has like some kind of like shape. So we just need, so you know, it might be something like that. So if you put that onto that leg. Twist it around a little bit. So I really don't like how it goes into like I suppose that's not too bad. Yeah, so I suppose we'll settle for that. I am, I am really, you know, too fond of this though. I mean, I suppose it's better than it just being plain. But I don't know. I was kind of hoping we could, we could, you know, do something really good here. But kind of just settling really. I mean, I know you might, you might be saying, well, just go on the community creation and download one, but it kind of takes, you know, the fun out of it trying to do it yourself. You know, you're not always going to hit a home run every time. So I'm sure he's like his knee pads now are like a silvery colour. So. But it's like a light silver, isn't it? So maybe something like that. Then we want image on there. So So we'll just put something like that on. Colour, turn that black. Set. There's that, that's that. So we'll copy that over. Like that. And then we're just going to change the boots. So I think we want to be like, like a goldenish colour maybe. So if we click on that. To that. Then yes, we want that one. Yes. And maybe make that silver like that. I think maybe make that black. So, I suppose when you look at it like that, it, it doesn't look that bad. Like I say, it's not really what I was, you know, hoping for. But I suppose at least it gives Kenny, you know, a bit more of a look. Even though it's not the potential one we were looking for. So we go to accept. And then... 
copy that across to there. Like that. So now when we go onto there, we just need to remove the t-shirt and then it's ready for in-ring action. So next I'm gonna show you his entrance so then you can see what it's like him coming to the ring. So and there you see the Kenny Omega entrance. So I suppose <laughs> yeah, it just look it does look all it looks all right. It's, like I said, it's not it's not as good as I was hoping it was going to be, but you know it's it's all right. It's you know it's better than what it was. So you know I suppose you know that, that's you know winner. So if you're wondering why he's got this entrance, it's just I had to use it for a video on the universe mode. That is why he's coming through the crowd. Um, but he's meant to have the AEW um, Championship, so I don't know why he didn't have the title. Because when he's got the title, he shouldn't have that entrance. But um, I don't know. So guys, let me know what you think of this Kenny Omega in the comments. If you do think it's terrible, please please just give me some feedback. Please <laughs> don't hit that thumbs down button. Um, but if you did like it, do hit the thumbs up button. That really does help the channel. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Make sure your notifications turned on so you know first when the next the Man's Games video goes up onto YouTube. So that is all from the Man Games today. Thank you for watching.